people it's not like they don't like you mm-hmm. but the fact is that they don't have access to you mm. when they get access to you you know that okay they actually like you so much and that has been my experience with people around here <laughs> I don't see myself to be weird. It's just person who said from that perspective. Well, if they exclaim that I'm weird, then weird I am. <laughs> <laughs> Audio jungle. Um, I am a fashion model, a pageant consultant, and a pageant coach, and I was into catwalk coaching. That's what you do, basically. Yeah. So, the, your brand, the way you brand yourself, have you always been like that, like, right from time, like, right from childhood? Yeah, it's been, it's been made from childhood. The way you see me walk, that's how I've been walking since I was a kid. The way I do my things, it's just been, uh, it's just been how I am. Right from... Yeah, right from uh, I've been a kid. So, you, you like change, you like you being changed. <laughs> That's funny. Sincerely speaking, there is nothing about me that I would love to change because I'm unique in my own way. And judging is a regular thing, but then again, they keep they, they say those things behind you because that is exactly where they belong mm-hmm. behind me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no doubt my style is sassy, but that doesn't define that crazy as people might see it. Yeah, mm, very weird. Oh yeah, I don't see myself to be weird. It's just person who said from that perspective. Well, if they exclaim that I'm weird, then weird I am. <laughs> um, I, I'm a strong advocate of. Um, I advocate in case primary success. So you don't have sex? No. And you don't. You don't do girl. You don't do relationship. Um, no, f- no for now. For now, but you've done like the past. Uh, should I, would I cut that relationship? <laughs> that was just infatuations, please. Oh. Yes. So, how do you feel when people see you like this? <laughs> this is a really funny and interesting question. When persons see me out there and they kind of wonder what person is this because uh, the, the, my type is not uh, uh, the right type. Mm-hmm. But then again, I would say that. Um, you know, people, it's not like they don't like you, mm-hmm. but the fact is that they don't have access to you. Mm. When they get access to you, you know that, okay, they actually like you so much. And that has been my experience with people around here. Mm. It's not like I decide to build my brand this way. Mm-hmm. It's just me showing the world who I am and what I am. This is my kind of person. And... Um, I strongly believe that one doesn't necessarily have to like come fit into the um, the standard that has been set by the society because we are more than that as human. We should not let the society define who we, who we are, please. Mm-hmm. Yeah. be like <laughs> i do not want to be like anyone trust me i want to be myself god have made me he has made me for a purpose mm. and that purpose i would want to achieve don't have a mentor don't have anybody you know, you just not at sound. all i do not have any mentor like while i was a kid i have some persons that i really liked their fashion sense but <laughs> i think it's just a human thing i had to grow these persons the first person i really liked um his fashion sense was um delilah gray and he's very good as we all know but then again okay i had some i had another person swanking jerry yes, these are some persons i love i love their fashion sense not that i would want to be like them the funny thing about me i am an educator and that is what most people don't know mm-hmm. i started earning at the age of 13 i did home lesson teaching ah. <laughs> yeah that was it that was when i used to say any when you but when you talk about modeling, I signed up with an agency that was 2018. 
then I began to work with um, clothing brands and um, showcasing for designers. So that was when I started making some cool cash from modeling. Uh, yeah. Uh, Let's get this right. I'm a fem boy. Yeah, and what we. What do you mean by femme boy? I mean, uh, I'm a guy that it's feminine. Okay. I act feminine, and there are a lot of persons out there, even in um in an institution. Okay. But the situation or the environment they find themselves, they tend to like hide their true self. But I feel that you should be who you are and what you are, regardless of where you find yourself. And the truth is that they battle or they struggle with acceptability, but. Sincerely speaking, I think if you know who you are, if you know your onion, you wouldn't beg for acceptability. They would accept you. I'm working hard to make myself indispensable. Mm. You can't do with mommy. <laughs> you can't do without me. <laughs> <laughs> Special. Special.